In assignment 5.1, you're going to continue the work that was demonstrated in the lesson on classification. So you're going to classify five additional railroads. So you're going to use the same file that was used in the lesson, but you're going to classify five additional railroads for a total of seven railroads being classified. Each railroad should be classified with its full name. There's a table provided to you that you can use to understand what the full name is, not the, just the abbreviation. And you're going to do this classification. You're also going to change things like the font size, what font face is used, and you're going to make sure that each railroad has a unique labeling color for it. So since there is only three colors in red, green, and blue, you're going to use combinations of red and green, combinations of red and blue, maybe a combination of all three, and you can change the weighting of each color um, with it. So 255 is fully saturated in that color. Zero is that color completely not seen. And you can vary the numbers anywhere between zero and 255. And so you'll have at the end of this project, seven railroads classified. We'll want to see the map showing the classifications on it. Each railroad will be in a different color and they will all be in the same font face. They'll all be 14 point size.